this morning an ROV or remote operated vehicle from the vessel Horizon Arctic discovered the tail cone of the Titan submersible approximately 1600 feet from the bow of the Titanic on the seafloor. The ROV subsequently found additional debris. In consultation with experts from within the Unified Command, the debris is consistent with the catastrophic loss of the pressure chamber. Upon this determination, we immediately notified the families. On behalf of the United States Coast Guard and the entire Unified Command, I offer my deepest condolences to the families. I can only imagine what this has been like for them. And I hope that this discovery provides some solace during this difficult time. The question was about the timing of the catastrophic implosion. Uh, right now, it is uh, too early to tell uh, with that. Uh, we know that uh, as we've been prosecuting uh, this search uh, over the course of the last uh, 72 hours uh, and, and beyond, uh, that we've had sonar buoys in the water uh, nearly continuously and have not uh, detected any uh, catastrophic events uh, when those sonar buoys have been in the water. We're going to continue to uh, investigate the uh, site of uh, the debris field. Uh, and then I know that there's also a lot of questions about uh, how, why, and when uh, did this happen. Um, and so, uh, you know, those are questions that uh, we will uh, collect as much information as we can on uh, now uh, while uh, the governments are, are meeting and, and discussing, uh, you know, uh, what uh, uh, an investigation of this uh, nature of uh, a casualty might look like. It is a difficult day uh, for all of us, um, and, and it's especially difficult uh, for the families, and our thoughts are with the families uh, today. Um, but uh, this was an immense uh, support, and we had the right gear on the bottom uh, to, to find it. So thank you.